the president and CEO of WWF Canada, and beside him, the linebacker for the Toronto Argos. Please welcome the one and only David Miller and James. I want to say it right. You're a Chuck. You're a Chuck. That's You're right. a Chuck. I'm a Chuck. We're all the Chuck. <laughs> We're all here this morning. Excellent. Good to see you all, and a happy Easter Monday to you both. Happy, happy Easter. Easter. I hear we will be working off our chocolates in a very special way, and we will be giving the Earth a hug as a result on April 25th and 26th. It is a weekend where you will be trekking up the CN Tower for a great cause. So, how did you both? I know why you're involved, of course. How did you get this young man involved? Well, I let James speak for himself, but he's a great football player and has an environmental conscious. So, on yes. April 25th, he'll be with hopefully 10,000 people over the weekend climbing the CN Tower. So, why is this so important for you? Uh, James? Well, I came from a house where we're always recycling, uh, thinking about the environment. I went to school, study environmental studies, so it was always a thing for me. And then in 2015, I wanted to get more involved, so I wanted to step it up. Literally. I've admired, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so he's going to step up. <laughs> yeah, I've always admired what the WWF was doing, so yeah. I started signing up for their events. And let's talk about that, David. You've been on the show many times, you know, talking about where the money goes. Because a lot of people, they get involved in fundraising and they think, what good is it actually doing? A lot of good has been made. Yeah, the World result. Wildlife Fund Canada has uh, had a fantastic history. Uh, this year is the 25th CN Tower climb. Uh, and the money in the past has supported preserving really important species across Canada. Uh, right now, we're working on helping save the polar bear, which is threatened by uh, climate change because yeah. the ice it's dependent on is melting. Doing a lot of work for the orcas in BC uh, and in the Gulf of the St. Lawrence and we're working on the fishing industry to help it become sustainable. Mm -hmm. Restoring so, the population so that they are sustainable. Yes. That's right and you know bringing in new techniques so in the future instead of having a choice of either you know overfishing um, or and not having nature we're trying to restore some harmony so you can have nature and you can have jobs and vibrant communities so a lot of really important work across Canada and internationally we support tiger work uh, in Nepal and it's those kinds of initiatives uh, that the money goes to incredibly worthwhile important and I think close to people's hearts and you get bragging rights because like these people you get to climb the top the tower have either of you ever attempted this I know as an athlete you probably think you have this in the bag right James or no are you a little bit concerned uh, uh, well, football, I'm used to going in six to eight second intervals, so uh, I'm going to have to change up my regimen a little bit, a little more cardiovascular, jogging. Training? Yeah. And how about you, David? I, I know you just you recently recovered from a bad knee. Yeah, I, I just uh, recovered from knee surgery, so I'm a rookie. I started training last week, so I've got a month. I don't think I'll hit the record, but I'm going up. Um, people, uh, some people run up. They do it under 15 minutes. It's amazing. Amazing. But we just want people to do it. It's easy to register. Go on our website, wwf.ca backslash CN Tower Climb. Uh, 5,000 people Saturday, 5,000 people Sunday, and it's free to register. Come out, raise a little bit of money, um, and uh, show your fitness. Great cause. Give the Earth a hug. And remember, Earth Day, of course, is April 22nd. Exactly. So we'll keep that in mind. And you know there's an elevator if you need backup, right? <laughs> Just, Just take care no, of your legs. No, once us. you're in, you're going up. You're right. Once you're on the 22nd floor, that's it. You got to go up, right? Yeah. Thank you so much. We'll be back with more BT right after this. <laughs> you know what? I will think about it.